Welcome back, everybody, to the Goalie Be a Pro. Currently, we are third in the league with, you know, actually a decent amount of games played. We have a record of 15, 6, and 2, and I don't know how we're doing good, but we are. And I have a feeling that we're going to get absolutely melted soon, but let's find out. We got Carolina here, period 1. All right, one nothing. we can handle that. 2-1, that's okay, and they have 29 shots, so this is, this is still a very open game like anybody could win this honestly the way i've been seeing our team play in the third i think we're in favor here if we if you don't go into the third period up by like three i'm just gonna assume we're gonna win also i found out on this controller maybe someone's been putting it in the comments and like screaming at me but there's a, a button it's like at the bottom where the microphone thing is i don't know if that will stop the controller from making noise or not or if it's like a microphone that like what a goal are you kidding me absolutely phenomenal but anyway, yeah, it's like a little button down here that has a microphone. So I don't know if that's like muting my microphone or if it's not going to allow audio to come out of it. But it's probably the microphone has nothing to do with the sound that comes out of it. Who knows? I guess I'll find out. Well, that didn't take long. Within the first minute, we already tied it up. Olofsson goes around the net to Cousins to Eichel. Goes, oh wow, he's wide open. Nice. He got to walk in, tried to take a shot, but unfortunately it did not get through. Here comes Feshnikov. He's going to dump it in. I would have got easy team play there. Had it not gone out. Teravainen now on the wing. Ooh, he kind of faked out our guy there. But luckily, Threes wasn't buying it. And he had a fire poke check there. Nice shot. That'll be kicked aside. But we are certainly getting our fair share of chances already here in this third period. I'd, I'm not sure what that was. I don't really have an explanation for that one. But I want to let you know that clearly neither does that guy. He has no clue what he's doing out there. No! Get away from back there. Ah! Why'd the poke check not work? It normally goes behind the net. That's scary. All right, Teravainen goes to Sveshnikov. Passes it out to Teravainen. Oh my word! Are you kidding me? I couldn't, like, it was just too far out that I didn't want to go for it. And then he just basically sprinted past our guy and got it. That's not a good goal. Oh, come on, man. That would have been a decent chance for a flying poke check, too, probably. Teravainen, nice. Oh, yes. Okay, good stuff, Savers. Great stuff, actually. Let's go, Plekhanov. In the middle to Reinhardt. Let's go, a shot! The rebound is given out, but he's not able to bury it. Huge save there by Carolina's Tendi. All right, back to the point. Threes with it again. Goes across. Let's go here. Let's go. Dalene in the middle. Oh, man, good shot. But once again, I think that one was blocked by our own team this time, though. But it was blocked yet again. Miller walking in. Man, oh man, we just can't get a shot through. Sebastian Ajo in the middle to Teravainen, who's going to let go. Probably one of the weakest backhanders of all time. I, I kind of want to have a compilation of all the weakest shots I've ever seen and find out which one was actually the weakest shot of all time. Vinny Trocek has it. He's just circling around his own end right now. Gets over to Pesci. All right, now they are coming back this way. They're back in the lead, so it is 3-2 right now in favor. Oh my, guy's just going to let one sing. But, yeah, it's 3-2 in favor of Carolina right now. Not the biggest deal. You know, you saw how fast we scored before and how fast we scored right there. 3-3 hockey game, 11-23 in the Thoid. And that fan is absolutely loving it. Come on, Eichel. Let's go. Do it. Do it again. Do it again. Are you kidding me with this team? Cousins. A baseball player. Part-time. Hockey player. Full-time. You know what? Reverse that. He's a full... What's going on with their goalie? That was weird. Cousins is a full-time baseball player, and he's just here to play hockey tonight. Boom. What a goal. And just like that, we now have the lead. That didn't take long, did it? Cousins. Imagine, he probably already has a hat-trick, honestly, but I was I don't... Did he get the first goal? I don't think he did, but he got the next two, so... Oh! That could have been a hat-trick as well. Or four, I guess, depending. Trocek to Marty. Doesn't get the shot off. Back to Pesci. Gonna go for a shot. That'll be wide. And go around the net. Miller gets pressured by two lads in red. Trocek now. Oh boy. Over to Pesci. He had like a wide open lane there and didn't take it. Shea down low. Trocek. I was... I can't remember. Someone said I was playing too deep in the net, I think. And I thought I wasn't playing deep enough. So I don't know. Maybe I got to challenge more. But then if they do a cross crease or something, I am just SOL. There's no way I'm going to get to it. Because I know you're supposed to like take the shot and the defense is supposed to get the whatever the... Uh, pass, but that's probably not going to happen. At least I personally see that as unlikely. All right, Seb, what do you got? 
Carries it in. In the middle to Terra Vinen. That's a shot that will be saved. And I almost got scored on by my own team. I don't know if that one got through. But I had a vibration on the controller. Which I thought I turned off. Or maybe that's only for like Halo. I don't know. Normally I turn vibration off. But I guess I haven't managed to get there yet. Anyway. I think that was a save then. Because it did vibrate. So perhaps. Actually in like older... NHL games, so this wouldn't be for NHL, it was for Halo, but I would literally remove the rumble packs from the controller. I would open up the controller, take the rumble packs out, and then reassemble it. So the controller was lighter, and it, you know, it couldn't vibrate at all, because then it is better for shooting. Because, you know, if the controller is vibrating, it throws you off. I was a tryhard in Halo, if anyone didn't know that. Come on, Skinner, back to the point. Oh yeah, let it go. Doesn't let it go. Well, he, he did, but it wasn't like a great let go. Gets blocked. Alright, that's gonna go to Carolina. Tara Vinen coming in. There's still four minutes to go here, so a decent amount of time left. But, man, I forgot we were winning. I thought it was tied again. We are actually in the lead right now. So they are potentially gonna pull their tendy soon, which is great for us. Svechnikov carrying it in. Three minutes to go here. Carolina is in need of one if they want to try and push for an overtime. Two minutes to go now. Pesci in over the line, that'll be saved. And I was actually about to pass over to the right, but that dude came flying in and I wasn't about to risk that. So we have a one goal lead here. Face off to the right of Tino or left, I guess, depending. I don't know which way it goes based off. Does it go based off the goalie or does it go based off of the, oh, that was scary. I don't like this, I don't like this. Trocek gets it, nice. Robert, you legend, picking that off with one hand. Just ease. Didn't even challenge him. Oh boy. Here they come. One minute to go. And Carolina needs to get on the board. I mean, it's not, you know, it's just a regular season game. We're not even too far in, so it's not super important. You know, it's not like every game matters yet, but I guess to some people it might. Nice, Eichel. Gets it poked off of him. Niederreiter now has it, and 25 seconds ago, they have to pull their goalie here, right? Like, there's, if they don't, I don't know what they're doing. Unless we literally just keep it in their end somehow the whole time. Is he going to come out? There he goes. He's off to the races. Trocek now has it. Oh, no! That was scary. I thought that was in, actually. Like, my heart sank. I already accepted that it was in the net. And that one actually is. That one is actually in the back of the net. Oh, come on, dude. There is only, like, six seconds. Don't you dare. Don't even... If they scored that, you don't even understand... I'm pretty sure I'd have to get a new PlayStation 5 controller. All right, some three-on-three -three action between the Carolina Hurricanes and the Buffalo Sabres. Who will come out on top? Stay tuned to find out. And it's probably going to be Carolina. There we go. Huge save. Ah, whatever. Pass that out. He can't get there fast enough. Let's go 7-1. Vicky over the line. Let's a shot go. That'll be saved, though. Has it behind the net. Gets it to Eichel. Go pass in the middle to Dullin, who for some reason tried to take a backhand shot. Riddle me that, because I have no idea what he was thinking. And then tries to tee one up in the slot right there. What's going on, Rasmus? Is this guy throwing? Oh, oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yes! Nice defense. As you can see, my plan to stop saying oh boy when things get stressful is going swimmingly. Very good at it. Terravine and coming in. By the way, that should have been a goal. I don't know how... He saved that, but he did nonetheless, as I just saved that one. That one was not nearly as good of a chance that we just had, but I still saved it. All looks the same on the score sheet. Eichel in over the blue line. Oh, listen, what a pass! No! If he went backhand, that was a goal for sure. Please don't go to a shootout. That is the last thing I want right now. Shootouts are the worst. Nice pass! Finally, let's go! Huge win for the Sabres, and that is going to be a third period. Well, it's not really a comeback because it was only 2-1, but... Ah! Uh, did they make it 3-1 at one point? And then... No, I'm pretty sure it was, like, tied, and then we blew it. And then we tied it back up, got the lead, and then we blew it. And, yeah. Okay. Anyway, you saw the game. I don't need to summarize it. They did end up with 40 shots, though, so fire me up. That's a 900 save percentage. I will happily take that. Joins the show here. What's up, Ray? Razor, what does that do? Never mind so much Razor. the confidence for the goalie, but for the rest of the team around him. Well, he was so I good didn't last night. Uh, play that good, Chief. I, you start to build a little bit of a belief system. Uh, 
with the player. And so as, as a goalie, I just ask to be traded you're, for the jokes. You're trying to get to a place where you feel comfortable, the team feels comfortable with you, and everybody's got to be an nice and, and comfy. Run, which I don't think anybody this guy's elite. Vote with a rookie goaltender. I, you know, it's a hard league to take a jump to. But if he can maybe springboard off this overtime win a little bit, they might have yeah, something Yeah, springboard. WWE style. Dusty. Them, they might have a little more going down the, the stretch here. Okay, we're going to pay a few bills here, but we're back with more with Ray. So I'm going to sim to the next game. Let's see uh, if we're in or not. Probably not. New conversation with the coach. Win the next game. All right, oh, let's I, get all you I got it. Didn't I? And all you hockey fans caught up on all, all the you action. All you poolies. What's a poolie? Like the a Sabres fantasy pool? Toe -to -toe I don't on know. The road against the Manny, how would you rate Buffalo your season so far? Through in the extra frame to come away I'm not worried about the Calder wins. Trophy race. I want the team to win. Yeah, yeah. Let's let's go Furda. Let's go Furda again. Coach dreams to hear that. Yeah, I bet. With a big night offensively. Huge night. The Maple Leafs were hoping to take a bite out of the wild. Toronto and did they? patted the stats on this night and e. pick up the easy win. Easy peasy. We are as cool as ice, and we are bringing you many more stories from the NHL. We're doing it next. All right. Well, we're not in against the Ducks here, so let's sim to next game. Are we in against the Rangers? Probably not. No. 16, 7, and 2. We are fourth in the league right now. 16, 8, and 2. James, I don't want to hear it, okay? We're going up against the seventh place Washington Capitals right now. We're sort of on a skid there, I think. We just lost the last two in a row, right? Unless I misread something. Yeah, we lost two in a row there. Okay, so got the caps. Let's go ahead and simulate this one. Let's go, Sabres! We are at home. We need a win here to bounce back from those two L's. All right, and it's 2-1 again. So I'm still, you know, putting us at the <laughs> the favorite here. Cousins gets it to Eichel in the middle. Back to Cousins. The passing plays are already unfolding before our ocular cavity. Oh, boy. <laughs> back at it again. Oh, boy, man, is back at it again. Nice. Stop him. I'm literally going to specifically focus for the rest of this game. To not say, oh boy. Olafsson, carrying it in. Oh boy, no, I'm joking, I'm joking. I'm kidding. Mantha in the middle to Oshi doesn't end up getting a shot off. I don't know what the heck is going on there. But luckily, Olafsson was able to swoop in and get the puck. Cousins over to Eichel with a tremendous shot, but a great save, I must admit, by one Zachary Fukali. Nice try again, but another great save. Dalene with the shot, and Eichel's going to get the rebound, baby. There it is. We have ourselves a tie game. It is 2-2. Two -two. Um, I think it's worth pointing out also that the Caps only had 16 shots coming into this period, so I got some work to do. You know, got my work cut out for me here. Boom, and the make it snappy. Going to bury it there. I seriously feel like that X-Factor did nothing in that situation, but uh, who am I? Dalene up to Olofsson. Come on, let's just get another one. Back-to-back -back goals. I mean, I would be down. I hope you guys are as well. Orlov gets it to Mantha. Anthony Mantha carrying it in on the wing. Goes for a toe drag. But Rasmus is going to deny him the shot. Nice. Nice breakout. Get it back to Eichel maybe. Or swoop around. You do you. Whatever works. Up to Eichel. Come on, boys. Here we go. Let's get another one. I want to be in the lead again. Feels good to be in the lead. It's less scary. Wow. What a pass and what a shot, but Fukali is honestly on fire back there. Draw win from the capital. Schultz carrying it up now to Shiri. What's going on, Shiri? Take the shot. You won't. He will. He will indeed. And that was a pretty decent shot. Well placed, I must say, but going to be saved by yours truly. Here we go, Skinner. Come on. Earn that contract, buddy. Earn that contract. Hey, you got a puck on net, I guess. That's a stat. If we go to two overtimes in this episode, I'm not going to be impressed at all. So let's try to avoid that. Dalene down low. Another great save. Reinhardt walking out. and Sick pass off the backboard and gets it back. Still not able to score. Holy crap. Fukali is an absolute animal right now. Big draw here. Huge, actually. Let's let's take it home. Let's take it home. That Yep, yeah, he did just that. Dalene has it at the point. Okay. All right. That was awesome, guys. Thanks for that. Miller walks in, another shot, and another face-off in the capital zone. I think we're going to win this draw again, but hopefully we don't do what we did last time, which was basically nothing. Eichel, you got this, champ. I believe in you. Nope, never mind. 
He took an L. Schultz gets it to Tom Wilson in the middle. Why did I slide so far that way? That was weird, but thankfully, still made the save. Good job, Tino. Cousins with it on the wing now. He does not play like an 82 overall, though. Seriously, holy crap. He has been on fire for us. Win that battle. It's two on one. If you guys lose that, I'm embarrassed. I'm honestly embarrassed for you guys. Tommy again. Tommy again. Nice defense. Yes, Rasmus. Legend. Miller. Over to Eichel. Tries to go in the middle, which would have been a sick play. But Shiri read that, unfortunately. Was able to pick it off. Carries it down now. At the top of the circle to Wilson, who gets another shot off. I tried to smother it there. But it was stolen from me. Good job. Good job, boys. Schultz has it behind the net. Good stuff. Here we go, Cousins. Carries it up out of the zone. Gets absolutely rocked. Wowzers. He's got to be injured. Put him on LTIR after that. Mantha's able to do whatever he wants. Just takes his time, but actually the defense were able to get their twig in there before he took the shot. And Mantha once again! Guy just walks out like it's nobody's beeswax. Can we stop that? Mantha again. If he does this, thank you. Number six for actually doing something that time. Skinner. Able to walk in. Nice shot! No, Plekhanov, if he got up close, that would have been an easy rebound goal. But instead, he decides to lay the body and drop whoever that was. Backstrom now with it in the slot. Over to Mantha again, who's going to get another shot off. That'll be blocked. Uh, they're yelling at me to hold it, but I clearly said, no, nah, not going to do that because that guy was open. And it turns into something. Never mind. I, th I thought it was going to be good, but we didn't really do much with it. Mantha again. No! Come on, man! I'm genuinely upset by that one. He kind of did a deke and I went to the left like ever so slightly. And I think that is why he was able to snipe me. I also maybe was playing deep in the net. I'm not sure. I don't really know how far back to play. So kind of just winging it as I have been for the last... How long have I been doing goalie be a pro since like NHL 14, 13? Something like that. And yeah, it's, uh, you know, it's it's been on and off with good performances and completely awful performances. So, I'm going to kind of just keep winging it. Probably, how do you not score that? That's my only question. kind of surprised that I'm not getting pulled. We've had consistent pressure for the last minute or so. And, you know, I'm just kind of chilling back here. We're running out of time. We are down by one, after all. Now, now you do it. Now you do it. That's a great time. Get off the ice, get off the ice, get off the ice. Get off! Yes! I got off. All right. So I played poo that game, I'll be honest. But, you know, well, I only let in the one goal, I think, right? Because it was 2-1 coming into this and we tied it up. So yeah, I let in one goal. It wasn't the best goal, though, so I probably should have had it. I am going to hold myself accountable for that one. Robert, nice. Good passing, boys. Win that battle! Oh, man, Zach Fucali playing Unreal yet again. Tom Wilson goes for the empty netter. Yo, he rifled that. That wasn't just an empty net attempt. That was trying to <laughs> throw it in our face, which I guess, you know, something Tom Wilson probably would do, to be fair. Dylan gets hit in front of the net. Fukali has it, passes it out, and that will be all she wrote. All right. Not, not, a, not, not a performance to be proud of on my behalf, for sure. But, yeah, it, it is what it is. It's going to happen, especially when we're like a... 70-something overall goalie. All right, James. Yep, let's go. You can roast me. Tonight in a lot yeah. With a lot to say about this. Let's open up the phone lines as well. We go to High River and check in with... High River. I did it again, the beast. Come on, get it right. I'm working. I'm not... I'm, all of a, a name change in the middle of the season I'm not used to here, sir. <laughs> You're kicking me when I'm down, too. This is a game I thought we could have won. You know, we lose this one... This is a type of game you want to see our goaltender steal one. The rookie just, he's got to find a way mm -hmm. to make that big save and get us a win in this situation. Well, Dog, I'm a rookie. Relax. Everything. He's still a rookie. Uh, I think it's a Thank lot you. to ask for a guy to be stealing performances here already. Exactly. Well, there's an expectation in that this guy, you know, he's How? highly regarded. How? He's got to pull out some wins like this, and he's got to steal some games for us. Fair enough. All right. Thanks. Jacarski for is the, the best goalie on planet East. Earth. Are you Confirmed. Now on that one, let's get back to the phones. Here we go. All right. Well, we are now six four and zero. The team is sixteen nine and two. James, when you think about it, let's sim to the next game and see if we are playing in it. We are not. The Jets. 15, 9, and 3. Pretty similar record there. We take a dub. Love that. Must have been Tokarski. Couldn't have been Sorokin, clearly. 
Sim this game against the Wild. And that's an L. We are up against the Penguins next. Back-to-back -back games. I'm still not in. And I think that was another win. Pretty sure we were at 17. What do you want from me, coach? Right, what we, do you uh, want? Welcome Ray Ferraro back to the show. And Ray and Is this going to be another having a holiday party same cutscene? I can't wait to get to in a couple of days from now, man. Yeah, we may change the address. You know, screw you. <laughs> hey, come on. I was excited for that. Um, hey, I wanted to ask you Oof. a little bit about the Calder race right now as we're kind of getting close yeah. to Christmas. We've seen that a ain't bit me. now. And, um, the hometown goalie, does he, is, he's not in the conversation, is he? No. I... Oh, that's, that's great. Just, no, and then that cut off, you know, okay, nothing else to be. No, James, for... you had your opportunity. So we are 18, 10, and 2. We now have a mission to get, like, a 935 over the next three games. Okay. <laughs> I'll do what I can, coach. Uh, we got Columbus coming up next, 14, 10, and 5. So, yeah, that was that. I will... See you guys soon.